right there. Look right behind us. That is a line of people waiting to get our stuff in the middle of a blizzard. How do you go wrong? And the other thing is, they, they wait in this line and they smile when they go out that side. That's the biggest, that's the biggest satisfaction. Absolutely is. So this is for Chefs of the Future. Chefs of the Future? Yeah. So it's a platform that connects the people that cook the food with the people that consume the food. Okay. From Big Guns, right? Yes. Now, like, where people can find you, first of all, what's your so, name? So, my name is Sean Keever. I'm the pit master here at Big Guns Barbecue. I was a competition barbecue chef on the KCBS circuit for about 15 years. That's why I earned my chops cooking barbecue. Now I'm based out of the middle of the Hudson Valley, up here in New York. We've been doing this beer, bourbon, and barbecue festival now. This is our third year doing it. And this is what we're doing now. I've kind of retired a little bit from the competition, and I want to get out to serving people. Um, so this is what we do. We do events like this, where we get to come out, hopefully not in the middle of a blizzard, but hey, anybody can do it in good weather, or if they're sober. I don't know why you'd want to do either, but that's why we're here. Um, we've been doing it for a long, long time. I don't really specialize in one kind of barbecue or another. I did competition barbecue for years. Uh, you have to make the judges happy. So we're here now just serving people. We're doing a little bit of a Creekstone Farms cross smoked prime ribs and beef and cheddar sandwich. Then we have a... Uh, we like to call it, it's our joke because we're here, we thought we were going to be in Queens, not Brooklyn, so we're not McDowell's, right? And we didn't want to have the McRib, so we have an, a really rib sandwich, which is actually a rib sandwich made with boneless Kansas City style ribs, much like what you would get at one of your fast food places, except this is actually a real rib. Um, so we're doing that. And the other thing we're doing is our Smash Boom Burger. The smash burger craze is going wild. Everybody loves them. I also work with my buddy Mike Puma from the Gotham Burger Smash Social Club. We do a lot of smash burger events. So that's our other event that we're doing today. So what would be the, the most rewarding aspect of like being a pit master and attending these events? And with you? Right there. Look right behind us. That is a line of people waiting to get our stuff in the middle of a blizzard, how do you go wrong? And the other thing is, they, they wait in this line and they smile when they go out that side. That's the biggest, that's the biggest satisfaction, that absolutely is. There's no more rewarding thing than seeing that. And us as chefs and cooks, that's what we do. We're down to please people. So when you please somebody, when you see them happy and they're smiling with something that you've created, there's a very tangible thing that you can put your hands on. There's no better feeling in the world, man. Absolutely. Listen, to be a chef, you know, to willingly put yourself in that position every single day, you have to be a little insane. That's what I tell people. You, you know, know you got to have a little screw loose. Yeah. But it's got to be coming from a place of passion. Listen, this isn't a work office environment. You know what I mean? We're working around hot things, sharp things, people yelling at each other. You're under pressure all the time. But we love it. We love every minute of it. Every minute of our job is a two-minute drive in football. And no offense to TV 12, I'm 57. He's a young boy. I've been doing this much longer than he has. <laughs> Thank you, Chef. I'm not married to a supermodel, but I love my wife dearly. Yeah. <laughs> So, um, Big Guns, are you on like social media? Or? Absolutely. You can find us on uh, Instagram at, B at Boom Boom BBQ. Kind of easy to figure out. I will tag you in this video. Yeah, absolutely. I'm a retired field artilleryman. That's where the whole thing comes from. I'm a U.S. Army retired field artilleryman. That's where the Big Guns come from. And we always hit Boom Boom. So that's <laughs> us. Thank you so much. Sir. Appreciate it, man. Thank you. Yep.